Hey, I'm Jay, and I've been diving into game development for the past few weeks. Now, a key component of developing games is the tools that are used in order to make them, namely the game engine. You get quite the range of characters when you look at people talking about game engines. Sometimes you get those diehards that are just, it's my engine, this is the only one to make a game in, to those who are more agnostic. Now, of course, I'm new into the space, so I can't say exactly, here is why this is better, and here's why this is better. Instead, I'm just going to say why I chose the engine that I'm using, which is Godot. Right off the bat, the scope of the games that I'm trying to make played a large part in my choice in the game engine. I'm not trying to make the next third-person 3D open-world RPG MMO roguelite on Mars or something. The scope of the games that I want to make, or at least all of the ideas that I've come up with, are either exclusively small 2D games or very small 3D games. And in fact, I even looked at just pre-built tools like Game Maker Studio or RPG Maker, where it's a little bit more user-friendly. But there was a difference with uh, with those offerings. I'm a programmer by, by trade, so I like to have a little bit more control than just drag and drop, which is what uh, was appealing about Godot, is that it was still relatively small in scope, but it also has its proprietary coding language, GD script, or even C Sharp if you wanted to do that. Needless to say, you're still able to code what you want to do in Godot, which I like. And I guess going back to the scope of projects uh, with Godot, I've dabbled with Unity a little bit. My friend and I started playing around with a game concept in Unity. I'm not claiming that I know both engines perfectly. I know both engines very little, actually. But my first impressions of diving into each of these engines, to me, stepping into Unity for the first time was like stepping into a factory where you have all these amazing equipment, these tools, you can do so much stuff with all of the, the, the things that they give you right out the gate. But you have to learn how to use the equipment <laughs> in order to leverage it to its fullest potential. The scale and the scope of games that you can make in, in Unity is amazing and incredible. It just, you have to take the time to learn how to put the pieces together. By contrast, stepping into Godot for the first time for me was like stepping into a workshop. It's a lot smaller. You kind of get a lay of the land relatively quickly but that doesn't mean you can't make incredible stuff. You might not be able to make as amazing things, particularly in 3D, compared to Unity, or especially Unreal, but the things that you can make are very well crafted without the intimidation factor, I guess. And again, this is my first impressions. I found Godot a lot more approachable for me. So what is Godot? The Godot game engine is an open source project that you can download on Mac, Linux, Windows, and the browser, technically, that you can use to build games. And you create games using Godot's nodes, which each serve a specific purpose and element of a game that you group together into scenes. You group those scenes together into a game. Another reason why I chose Godot is because it is open source. I'm a big fan of open source projects and communities that are built around them. You kind of get that sense that this is something that we all made together. We're contributing to it just by using it even. We're contributing to it, which I think is just really cool. And knowing that it's not just one company dictating how it's how it's done, I, I really like that kind of communal say into what goes into a project at this scale, which is which is nice. And of course, with it being open source, you essentially own the rights to the games that you make. There's no runtime fee, fiasco. I'm not gonna beat a dead horse with that one, but what you make is what you own, which I think is really nice. But of course, with all of these considerations, it is just a tool. I'm just dumping reasons and why I chose it onto you. So if you're a Unity diehard or an Unreal guru, that's great. They're tools. It is a poor workman who blames his tools. If you have a good idea for a game, pick a tool and build it. Don't blame the engine if the game itself sucks. For me, I like Godot, and I'm gonna stick with it until I have a reason not to. But I'm opening it up to you. What game engines do you all use and why? Fire off in the comments, because I'd love to hear it. And if you like listening to me ramble about things related to games or game dev, make sure you subscribe to follow along. Before you leave, if you like to hear me ramble some more about why I think video games are such a great platform for storytelling, check out this video. All right, that's it. See ya.